TJ Randolph and welcome to my music vault. I am sharing music and songs from the soundtrack of my life growing up and coming of age in the 80s. Some 90s, like the song I'm going to play for you now. I was a young adult in college. Oh, actually, I just grad I graduated from college. So, um, yeah, I was living my life as a young adult. In 97, I was, where was I in 97? I was back in Oklahoma City. I was a mom by this time. I had my daughter in 94. I was a mom by this time. But the reason why I'm playing the song for you right now is uh, my husband's a truck driver. And when we were courting, we would send each other love songs. And this is one of the songs that I would send to him. You know, when we are not together, so, you know, physically together, we're together through music and different songs that make me, help me express what he means to me. And even when I'm, you know, kind of down or whatever, for whatever reason, um, you know, he, he just puts a smile on my face. Every time he calls me, he said, how you doing? And I always say better now. <laughs> so this song was released in 1997. I think I said that by Anita Baker. I don't know, you know, for my R&B lovers, I know you know who this is. My pop lovers, I'm not sure if you know, but she is a songstress, a soul songstress. Again, another powerhouse vocalist uh, who makes you not only, you don't hear her music, you feel it. And this is one of the songs. And this, is, this song here is called You Bring Me Joy. I dedicate this to my husband. This is one of the songs I would send to him, you know, um, I'm thinking about him so you bring me joy so let's get into this one Okay, you see, it's already happening. <laughs> um, when I, you know, I don't know if I shared with you all, I met my husband online. I don't recommend for everybody. We were just very fortunate to find each other. Um, but when he looked at my profile, uh, he didn't reach out to me, but I saw that he had looked at my profile. So I went to look at his profile. And when I saw his face, he had the warmest smile. Just welcoming and... Um, a beautiful inviting smile so when we had our first date you know three days late well when we met online and we had our communications we would talk for hours like we used to do y'all young y'all the youngest don't know nothing about this because y'all be texting and stuff like that but we actually had phone calls where we talked on the phone for hours and hours and hours when he you know when he wasn't driving of course and our first date you know we went to a, a dinner and a movie and when he 
when we got ready to depart ways, you know, we didn't kiss, you know, he hugged me, but he hugged, he held, hugged me so tight. And it wasn't an awkward hug. It was just, you know, it was tight. <laughs> I could barely breathe actually. But he said at a later time that that was his way of letting me know that he wanted to see me again. So, so again, when I can't see your face, I remember your smile. His smile is what invited me to him. And you know, yeah, he did reach out to me, but when I saw his, his smile, when I looked at his profile, I reached out to him and the rest is history. So let's finish the song. But can this be right? Oh, when should we be friends? I get lonely sometimes And I'm mixed up again Cause you're the finest thing I've seen in all my life You bring me joy Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. <laughs> that got me. That got me. You Bring Me Joy by Anita Baker. The songstress. That was she, that's what she was called in the day. She made her debut, I think, in the 80s. If not the 80s, early 90s. But the strong songstress. Let me know what you think in the comments. Please like the video and subscribe to the channel and share if you think someone would like this music from the soundtrack of my life. Okay? So until next time, ciao for now.